Hi, welcome back to Avocet Math. In this video, we're going to look at yet another problem from our set of AMC 12 counting problems. So let's see what we have. How many of the numbers 100 through 999 have three different digits in increasing order or decreasing order? So essentially, the total number of three-digit integers that have digits in either increasing or decreasing order. So this is uh, a little bit similar to the AMC 12 underscore 4 problem that we'd seen just a little bit before. So let's see how we might do this. Um, I'm not aware of any way to do this problem in one shot, so it looks like we're going to have to do this in cases. We're going to have to treat the increasing order as a separate case from the decreasing order, and then just add up the, uh, the two cases at the end. So let's look at the decreasing order first. So it appears in order to form a three-digit integer with a decreasing order, we can select three possible digits out of the set 9 through 0. And any such combination of three distinct digits from the set 9 through 0 can be rearranged in decreasing order and form a valid three-digit integer. So essentially, this comes down to a combinatorics problem, just like it did in problem AMC 12 underscore 4. So we essentially have... Uh, the number of integers determined by the ways that we can choose three distinct objects from a set of ten distinct objects. And that, of course, from our combination math is uh, C10 choose 3, which is 10 times 9 times 8, 1 times 2 times 3, which is equal to 2 goes into the 8, 3 goes into the 9, 10 times 3 times 4, for a total of 120. Now let's look at the case of increasing order. So it's tempting to do the same thing where we look at the digits from 0 through 9 uh, in much the same way that we did for the decreasing order. But here's the wrinkle in the problem that we can't really choose from the set of digits 0 through 9 because any way that we select, any way that we can possibly select a 0 uh, ends up forming an invalid three-digit number because the zero, when we arrange it in increasing order, would be shifted to the left, and we don't allow for a zero leading digit in a three-digit number. So essentially, we have to choose these digits from the set one through nine, just as we did in problem AMC 12 underscore four. And after we do that, the problem is pretty much the same as the first case, where we now have to th choose three digits from a set of nine using our combinatorial math and that works out pretty simply as three, two goes into the eight, seven, and that's 12 times seven, 84. Summing these two together, 120 plus 84, 204, and that is choice C. Anyway, fairly simple if you break it up into two cases and you realize that you cannot have a zero as a leading digit in a three-digit number. And if you need a little more explanation as to why we do it that way, check out problem AMC 12 underscore 4. See you next time. Bye-bye.